The photos show the young prince at his family's estate in Norfolk, smiling barefoot and innocently giving his cocker spaniel Lupo a lick of an ice cream treat. And that's when social media exploded, with some saying the royals were poisoning their pet. And this tweet, why is Prince George trying to kill this dog by feeding it a white magnum? And then the RSPCA weighed in, the National Group Preventing Cruelty to Animals. We would advise people to be cautious when giving their dogs food meant for human consumption. Dairy items can be difficult for them to digest. And yet so many do it. At this ice cream store in Winnipeg, the doggy sundae is a popular treat. It's just vanilla ice cream soft serve with a milk bone on top. And on a hot summer day in the park, these dog owners say Jackson and Togo also sometimes get a lick. Oh yeah, he loves ice cream. Just vanilla though, right? Just yeah. vanilla, no chocolate. According to vets, when it comes to our pets, a place much more dangerous than the ice cream store is the garden. Any products that include garlic or onions, which can kill red blood cells in a dog's bloodstream, macadamia nuts can cause neurological problems in dogs, grapes and raisins um, can cause kidney problems. And of course, chocolate. And too much ice cream for dogs can lead to an upset stomach or possibly pancreatitis. But the sample little George offered his pet likely didn't do any damage least of all to the royal reputation, which by the end of the day had millions around the world melting over the ice cream photo. Jill Mackishon, CTV News, Winnipeg.